G'day, it's Pete here and I'm back for another weekly free instant tournament. This is an 8 board uh, BBO tournament that you can play on BBO by going Solitaire Bridge and then weekly free instant tournament. So give it a shot before you watch this. Anyway, uh, we'll jump straight in and see what we can actually do. Okay, so here I have a balanced 15 count and my partner opened one spade. Uh, I've got stoppers in all the suits and a 4 triple 3 shape. Um, now, the robots do play 3 no trumps is like a balanced choice of games, like 13 to 15 with 3 card spades. So I could do that, um, or I could go out of my way to actually really try and play 3 no trumps. Uh, but I think leaving partner in uh, with a choice is a good idea. So if they've got a balanced hand, they can uh, pass it. So they've got 14 points. And the first thing I want to do is compare how would... Uh, four spades play compared to three no trumps. So lots of people will be in four spades and I want to just see does how many tricks does four spades take. Like they've got a spade loser, a potential heart loser, two diamond losers. They can get rid of a diamond on a club so they'll lose one diamond, maybe one heart if the heart finesse fails and maybe only one spade if spades uh, break. So there, they could make 11 tricks at, at the very best, losing one diamond and one spade. Um, so I need to find out how spades are breaking, and I need to find out if the heart finesse works, because I want to make sure I make as many tricks as the spade contract does. So settling for nine tricks isn't any good uh, if four spades is making ten. So I need to make sure that I make as many. Um, right, so entries to this north hand are probably more important. Uh, so let's just uh, let this run around. And I sort of want them playing any other suit, so... Like, if they open up diamonds for me, that's good. If West plays a heart for me, that's good. So, I want to tell them that I've got clubs really well locked up. And I could go King of Spades, Spade, um, towards the 9. That probably is the best in case there's a singleton honor here, Queen Jack 10. So here, if I play a low Spade and just cover what West does... Okay, so spades are three, two. Okay. So, I'm up to three club tricks and four spades, uh, which is seven. I have two hearts is nine, and a diamond is ten. Uh, if the heart finesse works, I want to take it. So, if I let this run to the ace and then play a heart towards the jack... Uh, then if the heart finesse is working, I'm all good. I'm just trying to make sure I make as many tricks as the people in four spades. So if I win this, rattle off my spades, I have to start making some discards. I could then play a diamond towards the queen, but if they return a diamond, uh, maybe they set up some diamond tricks. Or if they return a club, I can't take the uh, heart finesse later. So if I win this and, yeah, like I, maybe I need to sneak one diamond through first. So what I want to think is that I'm taking a heart finesse into this side. Yeah, I kind of wish I actually had more entries to my hand now. So what I want to do is I want to play one diamond through, um, Like, I wanted to get one diamond trick and then take the heart finesse. But if I do that, uh, then they can... Uh, if, if I play a diamond and I'm, I'm currently in the wrong hand, I want to lead a diamond towards the king. Because if ace takes the ace, like, they can return a diamond straight away. That's the worst thing that they can do for me. Um, but other than that, there's not a lot they can do. I could play three rounds of spades and see what actually happens here. Um, I want them to discard some diamonds or things like that so that it's safe. So three of hearts, 
We've got one diamond discard there. Another diamond discarded. And it looks like the heart finesse is working here. Okay, diamond to the queen that held. Um... I'm just going to take a heart finesse at this stage. Nice and safe. Wow. <laughs> Wasn't expecting that heart finesse to lose, but uh, yeah. I guess I should have returned a diamond. No, nah, but diamonds were poorly placed. Anyway, 68%. Um, could have played that one a bit better, but uh, people in four spades only made 10. I wanted to make sure that I did as good as the people in four spades. Some people made 11 tricks. Uh, one in spades, two in no trumps. Um, can I make 11 tricks? Wow, I can make, yeah, make 11 tricks. So let's see what I actually have to do. So club lead, I win, and king of spades, spade. Surely this is all okay? No, it's not. So what do I have to do early on? Ah, uh, okay, so because East only has three clubs to start with and two hearts, I can strip uh, the side suits, so I can cash the Ace King of Hearts, I can cash three rounds of clubs, and then if I play three rounds of spades, they're in, and I have to lead a diamond around, I win the King and just play a diamond back, and that's how I get my 11th trick, which isn't a very practical line of play to legitimately make it. Might have been a, another way to uh, get it a bit better, but anyway... 67%, good start. Um, here, 14 highs, 5, 4, 3, 1. I'll just start with a diamond. Part a bit of heart. So here I'm a bit awkwardly placed. So a couple of different choices. I can either bid two clubs or I can bid two hearts. So if I bid two clubs, my partner might bid something like two diamonds, in which case I can then correct to two hearts, which should be an invitational hand. And I think I just scrape into it. This is sort of the bottom uh, I could actually be for that. Balanced invite, I'm going to accept, but I'm going to round out my shape at the moment. So three hearts, and my partner says four hearts. Okay. So we're in four hearts here. So, huh, my partner's only got a four card heart suit, but they've got ace third spade, so they know that's not particularly good. All right. Um... So, I've got four heart tricks, two clubs and a spade. When I'm in a moise, I like to uh, somewhat count it as if it's no trumps and count winners. Um, if I can draw trumps and guess the clubs correctly, I can get four clubs, four hearts and a spade. So I need to take a spade rough. So I need to uh, win the eight of hearts, cash the king of hearts, Play a spade to the ace and rough a spade. Then I need to guess clubs correctly, and it's most likely that I want to play east for the queen of clubs, because I can play a club to the king, draw trumps, and then play a club back. Now, what do we know about this hand? I open a diamond. The opponents have nine spades, and no one overcalled a spade. And they both had an opportunity to. So whoever's got long spades, five spades, doesn't have very many points. Um, so let, let's start with the line of play that I know I have to do so king of hearts, ace of hearts, spade to the ace and rough a spade oh uh, no <laughs> oh no misclicked, wanted to play a spade to the ace All right, um, well, I'm now going down, so let's draw another trump. So at least I want people that are in four hearts to be going down as well. So I want West to have the queen of clubs because it's kind of more awkward to play them for the club queen. So I'm trying to minimize my uh, losses here. Okay, so East had the Club Queen, but at least uh, hearts were, clubs were 4-1, so that's no good. Alright, 
And we'll just take our uh, two club tricks and go home. Ah, uh, misplayed. Uh, probably would have gone down in this anyway. Um, but I would have got another trick. 17% for going down two. I guess that maybe I wouldn't have got another trick because uh, I would have got three club tricks, four hearts, and a heart rough is... So I would get five heart tricks, including the rough, three clubs, and a spade, so down one. That would have got me 42%. There are some people in three no trumps. I, you can't quite make... Uh, yeah, you can't quite make four hearts with the bad split. But what I wanted to do is, if clubs were 3-2, then I would have been all good. Uh, three no trumps is actually a better spot on this, because we've effectively got nine caching tricks. Um, but it's hard for your partner to tell. And I can understand why they tried uh, four hearts there. But basically I should be in this 42.9% uh, marker, rather than the... Um, Rather than in the 17, but misclicked, went down. But I think four heart, like how I bid it, I'm happy with. Uh, it's not unreasonable to get to four hearts. Obviously, three no trumps does make on this hand, but uh, yeah. Anyway, uh, in rank 11, running at 42. Balance 20 count, really good 20 count, but I'll just open two no trumps, and partner was happy with just three. Okay, so we have a massive club fit. We have six club tricks, three diamond tricks is nine, a heart trick is 10, a spade trick is 11. So we just want to uh, potentially just cash our diamonds, cash our clubs, take a spade finesse. Now, I don't think I'm in any rush to take the spade finesse. So I'm just going to like win the ace and just rattle off five, six rounds of clubs, pitching a heart, and see what the opponent make the opponents make lots of discards. On this hand, six clubs is actually cold. Uh, pretty tricky to actually get there, but haven't been in the right spot yet. Like as I said, I've got a really good twenty count. So anyway. Uh, I think that was a diamond now heart and a spade. Ace is pitching spades. So West had a void. Okay, so here we are, and it's time to take a spade finesse. I feel. Okay, so that worked. And now, cash the ace of spades, and now two rounds of diamonds ending in the dummy, and see if I uh, manage to miraculously squeeze someone, which I really doubted. Yeah. 39%, <laughs> that's what I get for 3 no making... Wow, three people managed to make an over trick. So they got a diamond lead, they won, they played a spade to the queen, they cashed the clubs. Okay, and they just made the opponents guess really well what was going on. Um, I'm not sure there's much else to it. Um, they didn't really take any legitimate squeeze. Not that I realistically had any with my really, really, really bad heart, heart pips. Um, so what they did was fine, but not too fussed about that one. But the uh, robots just misguessed. Okay. So I'm in rank 12 on 41%. Still not upset with anything I did except misclicking. Um... So here we've got 10, 16, 18 points, balanced hands, so I'll start with one club, rebid two no trumps. Nope, I'll just play it in one club. Okay, so we're in a 3-3 fit. Partner's got five points. 
There'll be some people that open one no trump, and they will be better off, I guess. Uh, we've got three club tricks, two hearts on that lead, and a diamond. I want to try and get a heart rough. So let's just stick in the queen of hearts, see what happens. I could have played low and let that run round, but uh, both are okay. So heart, heart, and we're keeping an eye out for the ten of hearts. May as well rough it with the nine. And over rough. Wow. Okay. Um, West had five hearts and didn't overcall one heart. So they had five really bad hearts. Um, so let's just uh, play low. I'm trying to compare the different lines of diamond to my hand and roughing a heart. And diamond to the nine. Or just drawing a couple of rounds of trumps and exiting a heart. I think I might try to draw a couple of rounds and exit a heart. Okay, so East had five clubs, West had uh, two. So East still has one more club. So if I exit a heart here, West gets to go heart, heart, so they get two heart tricks. Uh, he still has another club, which is three. Uh, they've got the Ace, King of Spades at least, which is five. And there are seven cards left. I'm still probably going to get a trick. They could get one more spade trick, probably, but not likely two. Um, although, if I don't cash my Ace of Diamonds, am I realistically getting anything else? Uh, so what do we know about the points? East has the King of Clubs, the Jack of, the King of Hearts, and the Jack of Clubs. Ah, uh, I'll just take the safe road, cash the Ace of Diamonds, and now exit and hope West has the Ace King of uh, Spades. King of Diamonds. Uh, East can always rough something. Uh, yeah. So this hand played out beautifully. 42% for playing in one club. I guess people in one no trump. They don't... They have sort of the same tricks. Where's their extra trick come from? So... Wow, one no trump is actually cold. So they get a heart lead and they win ace. Jack of hearts. Club over. Ah, oh, there's king ten Dalton diamond. Yeah, that, that makes it a lot easier. Whereas one club in your 3-3 three, three is just down. Um, that's really unfortunate. Here we do actually have an 18 count. So downgrading it, don't really see the point. But obviously punished again. Running at 42% in rank 11. Okay. Balance 12 count. Start with pass pass to me. I'll open a spade. Four clubs splinter. Hmm. Double. Uh, my hand's like, I'm not going any further, but my hand works really well with a splinter. Three little clubs or jack third club effective. Um, so, Ace of Diamonds. Uh, Means we've got one diamond loser, one club loser. I can rough, I can rough a heart, and I can rough uh, two clubs. Hopefully, that's not a singleton ace of diamonds, but it would make sense that it is, seeing as they uh, led it before leading the club. Okay, they're not really testing us here, so now I can just draw trumps. Ah, oh, it wasn't a singleton. Um, but yeah, so now I just need to rough both of those clubs. And yeah, I'll just claim making plus one for 60%. A really flat board, I would have thought. Uh, so 
one person passed it in. They got this is clearly not a pass. One person in five spades down one, and one person in six spades. As I mentioned, the splinter makes your hand really good, but we have an 11 count, so, like, the jack of clubs is wasted, so it's just good that you've got it rather than anything else. Anyway, up into rank nine, 45. They're bringing this back. Uh, nine, uh, 18 highs, four, five, one, three. I'll start with one heart. And can I make slam opposite this? So if my partner's got ace, king of clubs and the king of hearts, so that's too much for slam for a two heart response, so I'll just bid four hearts. Okay, so spade lead. We've got a diamond loser. I've got a, no spades. I've got a club loser. My diamond might be able to go on the fourth round of clubs. I could also try and pull a diamond towards the king now. Uh, I've also got some heart losers that I have to deal with. So, how do I want to do this? So... I could just win and play Ace of Hearts, Queen of Hearts. Uh, then, if Hearts are 3 2, they have to cash the Ace of Diamonds then and there to actually get the trick if the Club Finesse is working. If the Club Finesse is working, I can play a Club to the Jack and then play a Heart to the Queen anyway. Uh, so that's probably slightly better. Um, Alright, but they now know that I have really good spades. But I still feel like club to the uh, jack is like the normal line of play. So let, let's go for it. Try and make as many tricks as we can. Okay. Heart towards the uh, queen. Alright, let's see if they underled. Don't think they did, but... Uh, They get their rough, and now they make me rough. And club up, and see if they actually just ducked it. No! Ooh, I saw, so I could have gone down uh, by my line of play if they got their rough in. 71%. So it looks like Ace of Hearts, Queen of Hearts was the play. Um, the spade lead did sort of look ominous that it was could have been a singleton, but... Uh, I still, uh, if the heart finesse, if the club finesse and heart finesse is working, it seems better to take the club finesse and then play uh, hearts from the top. But uh, some people obviously went down. Some people made eleven. So how did they make eleven? Spade, ace of hearts, queen of hearts, and then they refused the club finesse. drew another trump, and then played the Queen of Clubs, and the robots didn't take their diamond? Wow. Okay, so that's an unusual way to make that, but um, interesting hand, how best to play it. Finally, I didn't get absolutely screwed by something like normal, I would think. Anyway, we're above 50% again with two to play in rank six, or equal six. Uh, let's see what we can do with these last two. Um... 5, 4, 3, 1, 14 count, singleton, king of diamonds. So, uh, it's normal to open one club, just considering one no trump here. So, if I open one club and partner bids one heart, I can just raise to two. If they bid one spade, I can raise to two, even though I've only got three card support. If they bid a diamond, I can bid a heart. So, yeah, for me, this is a one club opening, but it's not outrageous to bid a no trump. And I'll just jump to four hearts here. My partner volunteered two hearts. Got a fit. And here we go. Um, we've got three spade losers and a diamond loser. Uh, West has a weak two in diamonds. Do they get a rough? 
they get a rough. Okay, so they take the first four tricks, and then the uh, rest of this is very simple, and making down one. 53%. So even if they didn't get their rough, we still would have uh, gone down. Someone got to six hearts, but everyone else got to four hearts, so very normal board there. And final board, uh, 10, 17. Hmm. Oh, wait, I just want to check. Did anyone open a no trump? Okay, so club, club, club. There we go. I found one. So one no trump. Yeah. See, uh, not completely outrageous. I knew someone would consider it. I I think it's worth consideration. Don't think it's the right bid. It's but it's close. Uh, 17, 6, 3, 3, 1 shape. Start with a diamond. Probably rebid three diamonds. Yeah. We'll do that. Three no trump. Okay. Jack of spades lead. I've got three diamond tricks. Two clubs. And a spade. We have to see how diamonds break. If they're 3-3 three, three, or jack comes down double turn. I'm all good. Uh, but let's start with a low spade. Okay, and we'll unblock the king of diamonds and cross over in clubs. Okay, so my diamonds are all running, so I've got six diamond tricks. Uh, two clubs is eight, two spades is ten. Um, so what do I want to discard? Uh, so no one overcalled anything really. Um, so, I, I probably want to ditch my spades. I don't need my spades in the dummy. I can also get rid of a heart. Okay, so here we are. Um, I don't actually have any entry to the dummy, so even if I pulled a heart up, I wouldn't be able to do much. That being said, I could cash the ace of spades and then play a heart up. Someone might have to play a club for me. Um, but both really held on to their clubs, it seems like. Um, I could also pull a heart up and then try and go ace of spades, exit of spades, depending on what I think is going on. Um, may as well try the king. Okay, so if I counted this like really accurately, I might be able to like safely exit a club and see what happens, but. I think I'm just cashing the king of clubs. If East had... Like, East could have... East can't have uh, king jack of spades, ace of hearts, queen of clubs. Well, they could if they were a balanced hand. But I can't remember how many spades they have. But it seems like they only had four. But I'll just cash king of clubs. Because I think the queen's with the uh, west hand anyway. No! Oh, I could have done it! 64% uh, on that final board. I uh, could have uh, pulled it into... Well, I could have got an over trick. So, let's just see. A couple of people managed the over trick. So, I could have actually end played the east hand into opening up the club suit for me at the end. Uh, they only had a 4-2, four, 4-3. Four, if I took my time a little bit more, counted everything, like I still don't know where all the hearts are, but maybe I could have guessed what was going on in hearts, and uh, if I did exit a spade and West pitches a club, then I know that they're probably not pitching down to stiff queen of clubs, so then I could have risked it, so maybe. 
a little bit sloppy on that final board, but overall 52%, uh, misclicked on board two. Uh, but other than that, I was happy with everything I did, um, but uh, the results just didn't come through today. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this weekly free instant tournament, and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.